Hi, I want to show you how you can watch such a multiplex panorama with live view with. So what you have to do here is to open the app. Let's um, create a new session and uh, choose as input type video. Drag the file here. Let's disable audio. We don't want to hear anything while uh, doing this. So let's see if the video actually does play. Yes, it does. Okay, what do we have here? We have here uh, four views and we want to treat each view independently. So how do we do it? We create three additional layers and each layer we tell as an input type that it should duplicate the previous layer. So now we have four independent layers, but all each of them is based on this video. So let's start the session. First I'm gonna pause the video, then I will toggle to the calibration mode. And now I will do one thing here, I will um, adjust the center for each of these uh, four views. So I will begin with the first layer, as you can see here, I'm um, in layer one. I will press the P button, or I can even um, press here. Then I will adjust the, the center. We start with the upper left view until it's central. So continue with the next layer. Again we choose the equidistant mode by uh, pressing on the cam mapping button here. Adjust the center for this view here. Next layer equidistant just uh, the center and the last one um, Okay, so now we have adjusted the center of those four views. Let's go uh, back to the first layer. Go to the uh, rift view. And now everything I will do now, I will do it with the rift on my head. Uh, because only with the rift I can judge how good the parameters I have to adjust here now are chosen. I can't tell it as good when watching just uh, the monitor, I will have to use the Rift. So now I uh, put on my Rift and what I will do now is to adjust the four views to be perfectly straight and distortion free. So let's begin with the layer 1. I just want to see layer 1, so I will press this button here to um, get into the solo mode. Then I will adjust the radius until um, uh, straight lines become straight. Um, maybe something uh, around this. Then you see all this other stuff are uh, still being here and I can cut off this with the clip radius. I will reduce it until I'm just having a good view of, of the stuff um, of uh, this view. So we'll, now I go to the next layer, press the solo button, and we'll do the same thing with this layer. Adjust the parameter until straight lines become straight.
cut off the um, things of which are still there from the other ones by adjusting the, the, the radius. Something like this. Okay, let's continue with the next layer. Solo. And make, it, make everything straight. Cut off things I don't want to see. And let's go to the last one. And I do the same thing here. So now I have um, straightened, uh, respectively, um, choosing the correct distortion for all uh, layers. So now I have to align them. To do this, I have to adjust the bank pitch in your parameters. That's. It. I can recommend you always to start with the bank and continue with the pitch and end with the your parameter because. Um, the rotation order is exactly as you can see it here. First bank, then pitch, then yaw. So I will start with the bank. Uh, uh, um, excuse me, I have to uh, choose the solder for this layer. I guess I'm not seeing it. Um, adjust this until it looks straight, and then adjust the pitch until they're satisfied. Maybe something. Something like this. Continue with the next layer. Make it straight in this direction. And in this. Um, if you turn your head around a lot, you get a, a, a pretty good impression of how straight everything is. Um, it's just to see even more. So let's um, go on with the third layer. Let's think only the pitch has to adjust it here. And the fourth. Make it straight in this direction. And then this. Mm, maybe thumbs something like this. Uh, so okay, now um, each layer is straightened. The last parameter I've adjusted for each layer is the jaw parameter. So um, let's go to the. I want uh, first. I want to align the first with the second layer. So I will mute the third and the fourth. I will first. I will leave the first and let's see it's a little bit. I'm um, sorry. Oh no! <laughs> um, I've struck my settings here. Okay. So now I'm just seeing I think this is the second and the first layer. And now I will adjust the jaw of the first, uh, excuse me, of the second parameter until it matches the first. So, um, okay, I have no orientation at the moment. So let's, um, I, I don't know what's going on here. So I will mute this layer and unmute the thread and try it again with the thread. Maybe I have more luck with this one. So this seems to be the front here. Ah, I see here. I ah, can see the, the steps here are um, uh, matched pretty good if I do this here this way. So let's go on with the fourth and just the draw here. Ah, uh, again here you have the, those steps. 
Okay, I'm, I'm satisfied. And now I will. Uh, have, it should be be pretty easy to to adjust the second two. So the hollow is here. Both books. I think it must be something like, like this, and I think I have to adjust the pitch or whatever. Um, I'm a bit confused. <laughs> so it's something like this. <laughs> I'm not so sure. Okay, let's try to, uh, to do it in this way. This must be here. I think we will do it in this way. So now we have a panoramic view. To increase the quality, I will uh, use a feathering. I will start with the topmost layer and adjust the feather. So you can see just smoothing the, the, the the boundary here. Then we adjust the third over here, something like this. The second. Mm -hmm. And that's basically all. So let's see how it looks animated when we go to the first layer because this is our actual video layer where we have the time control here. And I will hide the HUD and press spacebar to start. Or I can hide if I click something somewhere here. Press space to to watch uh, the result. It's not too bad. So perfect, but it's watchable. Is it? Mm. <laughs> I'm not sure. But I think you get the idea here. Yeah, you can play uh, around a lot with this, uh, improve it as much as you like. But I think you should not get the, the basic idea how, how you, you have to do it. So, thank you.